Hello there and welcome to another video. Here is part 3 of the Unity tutorial I posted a couple of days ago. Alright. And uh, in this video we are going to make our player or character uh, be able to advance to level 2. So let's get started. Alright, so if you have been following the past couple of videos, you should have something uh, similar to this. Where if you fall, you will respawn uh, back again at the uh, respawn point okay so we're gonna make it uh, so if your character collides with uh, another object we are going to send the player to level 2 all right all right so let's start by inserting another 3d object all right uh, this doesn't have to be a cube let's uh, label this uh, finish all right let's give it a tag uh, this will be finish but you can um, add anything you like here, really. I'm just going to call this one finish just because we can. Let's open the code. You can find this under the description below. Let's open loop layer. And um, let's paste this right under these two Boolean expressions. Okay. Scroll down all the ways to uh, avoid start. And we're going to copy this code here to handle our our collisions. And uh, if a collision happens with an object name finish, all right, we're going to get to move to level two, which will be um, specified here in this um, string. Okay, so I'm going to select my main character or cube. And you notice that I have a, a new um, string here to fill out. Let's call this one next. Uh, actually, level two. Okay. I'm going to save this. And um, I am going to um, say the same thing as uh, level two. All right. I'm going to double click on it. And um, I'm going to select the camera to change the uh, background color so we know we are in level 2 okay so let me uh, save this go to um, frame 1 again and uh, I'm going to um, set the um, my uh, the box okay to is triggered all right and uh, if you run this right now You'll notice that it doesn't work and you actually get an error message down here about the uh, build settings so with level one selected we are going to uh, open build settings and let's add current level let's select a level two and let's add this level as well all right let's return to level one and let's try this out and you notice that you get to go to uh, the next level all right all right so you can see that this is not very hard all right of course you can do this a lot faster in click infusion 2.5 but it's always good to know the uh, different programs um, if you wanted to um, go to level two um, from level two to level three um, all you had to do is um, change this uh, to level three in level two and obviously save another scene as level three and uh, if you wanted to go back to level one you could do the same thing uh, you could have another object that takes you back to um, to level one all right all right thanks for watching